YouTube, what's up? It's Who is King Sean, and we back again with another banger. Today, I'm bringing you another business credit card, and by the way, I'm adding a business line of credit. I'm gonna show you the steps you need to do to get approved for this money. You could get approved for a $25,000 business credit card, or you could get a $25,000 business line of credit. So you already know, get your pen, get your paper, because we got things to talk about. So today, we will be talking about the BMO Harris business credit card, and just let you know, um, this is a bank, of Montreal which is located in Canada which is the biggest bank in Canada now I'm gonna show you the states that you'll be able to apply and be a member with them but guess what after I tell you the states I will be telling you at the end of the video the hack to get in here and I'm calling it the backdoor hack if you don't live in one of these states so on this list is Chicago Indiana Arizona Missouri Minnesota Kansas, Florida, which I live in, Wisconsin, and California. So if you're in those states, you will be able to join without any kind of issue. You'll be a member and you'll be have access to all the different products, personal credit cards, business credit cards, whatever you need. Now, you want to know the backdoor hack? Again, stay locked in with me. Now, they have the two great products, again, which is the what? The $25,000 business credit card or the $25,000 business line of credit. Now, you could get both of them. It could vary. So let's say, for instance, you got approved for a $30,000 card. They could approve you for a $20,000 business line of credit because they'll stop at the $50,000. They'll go up to the $50,000. So it could vary. Or you could get approved for a $10,000 business credit card and get a $40,000 business line of credit. It all depends. For me, go after them business credit cards, double back, and go after them business line of credit. Now, here are the requirements to getting approved for this business credit card. So stay locked in. You need a lease. Listen to me clearly. You need at least a 650 credit score and higher to get approved, right? And now 650 is to get in the door, but I always try to tell you to maximize your amount that you're going to get always is always going to be great to have a higher score. So if you have a 700, now you're getting up in the area where you could really capitalize and get in that big lump sum of money. But as long as you got a 650 and more, that's the requirement they ask for. You need to have an LLC at least 90 days and have under five inquiries in the past 12 months. So let's you know show you a little bit about these different cards right here. And the great thing, I want you to look clearly, right? Right? They got the business platinum reward master and they got the business platinum um, master card. And on this one right here, as you see, you could get the annual fee again, zero dollars. And you got the APR for nine months, and then you see the um, APR after that will go from 19.99% to 28.99%. So let's go over here to this side, which this card is the card I like. Why? Let me highlight. We ain't even gonna talk about the annual fee um, and the APR after the, you know, it finished after the 18 months, but check this out. This APR is 0% APR for 18 months people do you know what you could do if you got approved today for 25,000 30,000 40 50,000 dollars right and you don't got to pay no interest on that for the next 18 months come on people let's wake up let's start doing the work y'all know my saying stop being lazy so go that extra mile and so let's get on to the business line of credit because I know y'all like talking about that too um what you're gonna need you're gonna need again at least a 650 right credit score you need to have an LLC the only different um, the qualification is gonna be a little higher you need to be in business for at least two years let me say it clearly you need to be in business for at least two years right you need to have at least three inquiries and less in the last uh, 12 months and and they don't ask for a lot of documentation, which is really good. You know, a lot of times when you go to these banks, Wells Fargo, Bank of America, Navy Federal, you know, they ask them for um, a whole bunch of documentations, which BMO, they really don't ask for a lot, which is a great thing as long as you've you got everything in order. So here is the backdoor method to get in this bank if you don't live in one of these states now, right? So all you will have to do, you could go right online, you could open up a checking account, you wanna build a relationship for at least 
three to six months and after that they will allow you to start applying for their credit cards for the business line of credits or whatever you do you know they got a lot of they got commercial they got a lot of options here that you could look into if you're really trying to um, grow your business and if you want the personal credit cards I'm just gonna let you know they do do a soft pull on the personal side let me make this clear they will do a soft pull through TransUnion so if your TransUnion is pretty strong and you're able to be a member um, they will be doing um, that inquiry right on your TransUnion so again people this is some great funding that you could get again you could grab a 30 here 25 here and double back and go get the business line of credit people we got to stop being lazy this is a great bank um, go ahead build your relationship start doing the work again get in the comments if you have a relationship with them like comment subscribe but for now I'm up out of here peace